Hey everyone, this is Super Afro Pre-K teacher James here. How are you? Thank you for checking out this video. In this particular video, we'll talk about some uh, recyclable games uh, that you can do at home. Educators, you need to check these out because uh, you might be able to use these when we get back to the classroom after this COVID-19 uh, virus goes down. So uh, stay tuned. Hey everyone, welcome back, welcome back. Thank you for uh, checking out this particular video. Um, as we said, uh, we have a game here we like to play with uh, some of our uh, students in our in our homes. Uh, many of us are at home due to the COVID-19 virus and so this particular activity, which is a recyclable tossing game, I call it, um, I would use with the creative curriculum um, as I do teach uh, students who are on the autism spectrum and we're using this particular curriculum as our uh, curriculum for the classroom throughout the year. So. Ordinarily in April, I would be on a reduce, reuse, recycle uh, type of uh, unit here. And so um, I would use this game with my students in the classroom. But before I get to that, I just want to give a big shout out to uh, my favorite superhero, one of my favorite superheroes, Batman. Dun -dun 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 Batman. Anyway, um, you got to stay to the end. I have a special. Uh, I want to show you something at the very end. But in any event. Um, getting back to this particular activity so i call this the recyclable tossing game and i would use this particular game throughout the unit uh, with my students and so it's very easy uh, parents if you're at home you can gather household items uh, and use these uh, items to uh, create a game uh, such as this and so here we go so i have plastic bottles here i have aluminum can um, and then also have pieces of paper that um, that either I have used or printed something on and no longer need. And so these things can also be recyclable. And let's see, also have the toilet tissue rolls, <laughs> toilet tissue rolls. And so all these things can be used to uh, play this particular recyclable game. And so it's very easy. So what you would do, just have the students uh, to toss, maybe from a distance or maybe at, as a tabletop game, have this, the kids toss these items into uh, the container so you can use like i have here an easter uh easter egg basket or a small container like a small dirty clothes hamper i picked this one up at dollar tree and so um you can use things around the house um maybe a large bowl to kind of collect some of these things and so there's two ideas with this particular activity one is you could use some of these recyclables to actually uh count and so um if students, uh, like I said, I teach students who are on the autism spectrum. Some of them are, most of them are pre-verbal. However, they still have the cognitive ability to kind of point uh, as you count up from one all the way up to 10. Sometimes some of my students can count up to uh, number 20. And so uh, this could become a math lesson. So, you know, let's count the water bottles. One, two, three, four. And so those would, uh, that could serve as a math lesson. And then afterwards, you know, do that several times. You can use these uh, recyclable plastic bottles to toss them into the container from various distances. You could also add um, a little bit of water in some of the containers to make it um, make some heavier, make some uh, lighter so that they can travel um, the distance that you would want them to travel. And so and also, again, um, aluminum cans, you can break out some aluminum cans. So another idea as well is that you could uh, have the kids who actually sort these materials. So I have three uh, toilet tissue rolls. I have three aluminum cans. And then I also have three plastic bottles. And so the idea would be maybe have the kids uh, sort uh, based on the size, based on the kind, um, you know, have all aluminum bottles gathered in, together in one area, all the plastic bottles and I'm sorry, aluminum cans, plastic bottles, and then uh, the toilet tissue rolls, okay? And one of the skills, some of the skills that we're looking at is, uh, you know, you want to, to build up the skills like joint attention. So maybe look at me, you know, have them look at you, uh, look at me, and then you can have them maybe, or you could toss uh, the recyclable into the container. Another skill that we're looking at is imitation, copying, right? Um, 
we want the kids to be able to copy some of the good things. And so like uh, with the recycle unit, you know, we want kids to maybe throw things into the trash can. So teaching the kids to maybe hand over hand to walk over um, after you've done it and put things into the trash can, those things that are deemed trash. And maybe if you have a recycle bin in your home, have the kids uh, take those items to the recycle um, recyclable container. Um, and then also we're talking about receptive uh, language, listening, the kids being able to uh, hear what you're saying and want them to do. And so um, we're going to go outside right now. We're just going to kind of practice and show you, demonstrate how easy this particular recyclable game toss can be. Um, I hope you like it. But before we go outside, I did say I want to share something with you uh, just to prove that I am a true Batman fan, a fan of Batman. So I also collect uh, um, Hot Wheels. I have a whole bunch. I have containers of Hot Wheels. And so one of the uh, treasures that I found the other other day, those who are old enough can uh, identify this particular car. It's the Batmobile from the 60s, all right? Wonderful car. And yes, I do play with Hot Wheels. And then for the newer version of the Batmobile, we have this one right here. I think this one's this one was in a dark night if you will speeding down the highway or whatnot so um so yeah we're going to go outside and uh practice show you how to uh throw some of these recyclables into the container thank you for checking out this particular video uh, do me a favor like comment or subscribe on this uh particular video leave me a comment tell me what you think if you could use it in your classroom for my special uh, early childhood educators and parents uh, just tell me what you think uh, let me know how easy uh, you can do this particular activity in your home all right let's go outside okay parents so check it out I have my recyclables out here and so the goal is just to toss these uh, items into this bin right here all right so if we have the kids take water bottles and just toss them maybe a certain distance into the container. And so the goal is maybe as you're counting, you're counting each of the uh, items that you're tossing in here, uh, just trying to get them to uh, toss them into the container and maybe have the kids step back. Again, we can put water in some of the uh, plastic bottles to kind of give it a little bit more weight so it can travel a little bit more, a little bit further, okay? So I uh, hope you like that activity. It's called the recyclable tossing game. Something easy, quick that you can use at home with the materials that you already have. You don't have to go out and spend a whole bunch of money, but just use some of the household items and uh, have fun with it, all right? This is Afro Pre-K Teacher. AKA James signing out. Do me a favor, like, comment, and subscribe. Peace out.